Hey everyone, welcome back to Proxlight. Today I'm super excited to show you how to build a sleek and professional data entry application using Python, Custom TK Inter, and OpenPy Excel. Imagine having a tool that not only collects your data with a modern interface but also saves it directly into an Excel file. Efficient and elegant. In this tutorial, I will walk you through the every step of creating this application from creating the entire GUI along with the functional code. So with that being said, let's roll the intro. Before creating this beautiful application which basically takes a name, contact number and other detail and saves it into a Excel file, we need to install Buildify. Head over to buildifygui.netlify.app and you will find this link. Click on it and simply install Buildify. With that being said, let's start creating the basic GUI of the app. So here is the Buildify. You can use the free version also to create this beautiful application. So let me show you by going over to title and let's change it to something like data entry. And this will set our application name to data entry. Now what I'm going to be doing over here is simply creating some label. So let's try out some creating some basic label with the foreground color like this one and let's name it like name. Looks great. Now let's hit this entry button to create an entry box over here and let's say enter your name here. All right, that's great. So if you want to create any kind of application, you have to follow the same step. Just copy and paste this again or duplicate this simply. And uh, let's say we want to enter an age. So age. And let's duplicate this entry over here. Enter age here. All right. So you can basically modify them over here. And you can add other parameters also over here as shown in the preview. But for now, let's create a very basic button over here. All right, so let's name it like submit. And let me change the width a bit like 300 would be great. You can add more options like here, like the gender and things you want to add. And once you are done, for example, in the app, we have added certain things. All right. So after adding all your options, all you have to do is go over to here file and export as Python. You can also export it as a real app. But for this tutorial, as I'm showing you how to code this entire project, let's export it as a Python code. And here I'm just saving it like app.py and you can save it in your downloads and let's save it. Before we dive into coding, we need to install the required libraries. We are going to use the custom TK Inter for the sleek UI and OpenPy Excel to handle the Excel file. Run this command in your terminal. Pip install custom TK Inter and OpenPy Excel. Once installed, we can start the coding process. Now, let's start creating the main application window. We will be using custom TK Inter .ctk method to create a dark mode theme and configure the size of the app. Now we have imported certain important modules like custom TK Inter, TK Inter and OpenPy Excel along with OS. Custom TK Inter provides a modern UI. We set a fixed window size for better design consistency and dark mode is enabled a sleek and professional look. If you have already created this entire beautiful GUI using the Buildify, then you don't have to write this code. You just have to code for the automation of putting those data into the Excel file. Now we will create that function that will collect the input data and saves it into an Excel file. So over here we have the submit data very basic function where we are putting in the name to get the name method contact to get the contact age, gender and address. Also we are going to use the if method so that it will show warning so that all the fields must be filled. Now we are setting up the file path which is data.slsx which is the extension for the Excel file. So if this path doesn't exist, then it will create a new path and also it will append it with the name, contact number, age, gender and address. 
Now, finally, on clicking the submit button, it will basically append the name, contact, age, gender, and address to the main file. And also, it will show a message box like success and data saved successfully. Now, this function resets all the input field so user can enter new data without restarting the app. We will create an instance for the application and run it. The GUI stays open and waits for the user input. And that's it, we have built a professional data entry application that automatically saves data into an Excel file. I hope this tutorial was really helpful and if it was then consider subscribing, hit that like button below, I will meet you in the video, until then, keep coding, goodbye.